Hello everyone, Sigmanator here. Welcome back to Silent Hill 3. Uh, let's have a look at that tarot card I picked up. I have not found this in the chapel. This is a real tarot card though. Let's have a look. Uh, 22 at the top, does that say? Yeah, X is 10, so 20. I'm assuming that's not a H. But yeah, 22. Eye of the Night. Well, I don't know much about tarot cards, so... But that's the way I need to go. Well, there's other doors. This is where I need to be. There's no reason to go back to the amusement park. Okay. Okay. Nothing else too interesting in there then. I don't have a map of this place. Maybe I do now. Chapel. <laughs> All right then. Cult scriptures, they don't look like worth reading. Hello? Dear God, please forgive me. I know I'll be put to death for the sins I've committed. And I'll go to my death gladly. And with a peaceful heart. <laughs> but please, grant me just a small piece of your everlasting mercy. Let me see my child once within your golden gates. Deliver me not to hell, but to purgatory. Allow me to atone for my sins there. I'll stand within the very flames of redemption, no matter how they burn me. Forgive me for my wicked act of revenge. And deliver the soul of my poor murdered daughter. Please, also care for the soul of the girl whose life I have taken. God. I am a child, trembling with fear as I stare at death. Soothe my tortured soul with your infinite mercy. Please, forgive me. Oh, I have to do something. Um, I, that one. I forgive you. <gasps> Thank you, Lord. <laughs> Don't know if that was the right thing for me to do. There's nothing more to be said. I have the feeling that there's someone on the other side of this door. 
But the door is shut tight and I can't open no matter how hard I try. Alright then. Interesting. That's my health. Bad. Right. You're dead. Was there anything on here? So many minutes here to fit to read. Uh, the notes such as the ball frame ain't anything either. Fair enough. Was that just a waste of bullets? I feel I fear that may have been just a waste. Is this a person? Not quite, maybe. But I don't feel like pulling back the sheets to see. Big Chungus. Another big Chungus. Blanket. I don't think I'll need it. I'm not cold. Cassette tape. There are a bunch of papers in the file. I get the feeling that it's hand a handwritten copy of some book. It represents the deity known as the Halo of the Sun. In heraldry, symbolizes a religious group. The two outer circles are charity and resurrection. The three inner circles are present, past and future. Usually drawn in red, occasionally drawn in black or other colours, but blue reverses the meaning into a curse on God and is therefore forbidden. I see. Thank you. 
Can you just die? <sighs> Bloody hell. Right, I have no ammo and no health now. Oh, okay, I'm just adding onto this map as I'm going along. Picture here of an angel flying into the heavens, nothing special. Okay. St. Nicholas, miraculous hands, a doctor of God. Didn't think dog, uh, God would require a doctor. St. Alessa, mother of God and daughter of God. St. Jennifer, unwavering faith under death blade. Circle means reincarnation, that's what it said on that paper back there. So death isn't the end, pretty good deal if you ask me. Thanks to reincarnation, I died as a lesser, but I'm still living as myself. But you know, just the thought of it is starting to turn my stomach. Okay. Belfry. Hmm, I wonder. No. Equip. Okay, I don't know what to use that for. There's no label, but the tab's been removed. It might be worth checking out. Okay. Oh, wait. Bobby Douglas is notebook, can't forget to give it back later. Oh, wait, there was... I was supposed to read all that. That was all new stuff. No word from police. Dead and fire. Priority low. What is she hiding? According to records, 24 years old. Client says looks 17 plausible. Lived in Portland till 12 years ago. Got wrapped up in a murder case. Harry shot suspect. Justifiable self-defense. Defense, so no punishment. Moved away immediately after starting after started to use alias apparently no connection with the criminal just some occult freak slightly off from way back originally from silent hill uh. i get the feeling i'm supposed to do something here
Oh, right, I need to move the picture. That would make sense. I'm not even going to question it. Nothing in this town is normal. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so you can fall down those gaps. Now we know. Oh, uh, lucky I did save there, actually, then. Okay. Oh, the footprints. I didn't notice the footprints before. Right, let's not fall down any holes. know what that is that was new this is some kind of asylum by the looks of it of course it is why wouldn't there be an asylum here Ah, book on the tarot cards. That might be useful. Tarot was based on the 22 Hebrew consonants and is said to represent the entire world. Each card number 0 through 21 has a particular meaning by reading these cards. Fortune tellers predict the future. For example, the first card, the magician, signifies creation, wisdom, beginnings or destruction and fraud. The second card, the high priestess, denotes... In intuition, harmony, faith, or dogmatism and arrogance. According to some texts, the Gardener deck had more than 22 cards. The Gardener deck does not exist today. It is mentioned only in literature. It is said that these extra cards were based on the lost Hebrew vowels and denoted other otherworldly, excuse me, transcendental existence, i.e. God. Really? No idea if that's true. Been a long time since I did religious education at school. Sheet of blank, sheet of paper, but it's blank. The moon tarot card. Uh oh. Vincent. Oh yeah. Hiya, Heather. Hi. You show up everywhere, don't you? Make me sound like some kind of unwanted pest. Well, who are you anyway? Haven't you realized that yet? Yeah, you're on Claudia's side. I told you not to put me in the same category as that mad woman. Well, you're pretty loony yourself. It's true. We believe in the same God, but I'm quite sane. Uh-huh. So why did you help me out then? Was that also part of trying to resurrect God? It's not uncommon for people to worship the same God and still disagree. God? Are you sure you don't mean devil? Whichever you like. The point is, that now I really am on your side. 
I don't want God to be born wouldn't be convenient. Much too unpredictable. So you've been using me to stop Claudia, is that it? Do your own dirty work. My dirty work? I think we both had our own interests in mind. You hate her too, don't you? You're the only one who can get it done. I don't have powers like you two. Besides, I always hated getting all hot, sweaty. Oh, really? I'm just looking out for myself. Everyone does it. <laughs> don't stand there looking so smug. You're the worst person in this room. You come here and enjoy spilling their blood and, and listening to them cry out. You feel excited when you step on them and snuff out their lives. Are you talking about the monsters? Don't worry, it's just a joke. By the way, I forgot to ask you. Did you get the seal of Metatron? What's that? You don't have it? Leonard was carrying it. You mean this thing? Yes, that's it. As long as we have that, we're fine. Here, take this. Thanks, I guess. Weirdo. What does it say? Moon Tarot card. Uh, 10, 50. That's card number 18. Found this in the archives. I don't think it's an especially good card. This magic square with strong protective and dispelling properties is called the Byron Seven Crest or the Seal of Metatron. It will bring results regardless of whether the target is good or evil. Its strength therefore places a very high burden on the caster as it is also difficult to control. It is not usually used. This is why it bears the name Met uh, Metatron. Metatron. English is hard. After the angel uh, Metatron or Metroton, also known as the agent of God. I see. Was that it? Otherworld laws. Tome of the Seer sounds like an occult book. It all says it's blank. Oh, another one. Silent Hill's Ancient Gods, a study of their etymology and evolution. What a mouthful. It certainly is. There is no religion that has remained unchanged from the moment it was founded. This one is no exception. When this relig religion fell into the hands of immigrants, it was deeply influenced by their own original Christian beliefs. For example, the traditional representatives of these primal gods may be given their names and descriptions of Christian angels, thus shared characteristics shared characteristics begin to appear. There is also one rare example of the chief deity, creator of paradise or lord of serpents and reeds, being dubbed with a demon's name. 
Of course, this was not done by believers, but by their opponents. Uh-huh. So the demons are really the good guys, is what I'm getting at from you. Is there a door there? Yeah, okay. Ah, oh, there's a lift. That makes sense. Okay, what's this way? Right, before we carry on that way, let's try out these doors. No. Your barred shut. Lock is broken. Here we go. That was tight. Where am I going? Well, this place is an absolute maze. I don't have any health items. I, I can't keep fighting monsters. Okay, where are you going? Stuck to the book. Oh, another tarot card. Got the full tarot card. This book. I feel like I have to read it, but at the same time, I don't want to. Uh, yeah, whatever the hell that means. Red liquid or crystals resembling blood, according to the Kabbalah. The name is taken from a herb with the power to dispel evil spirits. It is said to grow in the Arabian deserts. It may be vaporized or applied as a poultice fucking hell, to guard against demons. It is powerful, but it is, it is rare. It is extremely difficult to obtain. Let me guess, there, there just so happens to be a supply here. Well, there's some bullets, that's nice. Yeah, I'll take those. 24 years ago, Mut Dahlia used me to summon God. God was in my womb, but I couldn't deliver her. Then I was shut up here in this hospital room. I stayed here until Dad helped me out when I was 14. God ate away at me from within, driving me mad with suffering. There I was, wishing I could just die and be done with it. But I went on living that nightmare for seven years. Looking at this bed just reminds me of those awful days, and I don't want to remember them because I'm not a lesser anymore. But a lesser is still me. I'm really not trying to deny it or anything. 
Fab. You're still looking at something on here. Picture of me when I was seven, I looked bored and sad. Well, of course I do. I was always like that back then. Okay. Oh, good. Yeah, that way's blocked off. All right. Excuse me. All right, where am I? You all right in there? I guess I'm gonna have to check all these areas for tarot cards. Yes, they're important. Ah, oh, good. This is a safe point. That's that would be useful. Got a brass key. Hmm. A, a memo book. Something's written inside. She's just beyond this door. I don't know how, but I can sense it. But she's not the only one there. I sense the presence of something extremely dangerous, even sickening. Or maybe that. Or maybe what they call God. Nevertheless, I will open the door. Enough of this idle tit chat. God, I'm not, but I fully intend to save her. No, them. The last entry was written some 17 years ago, and here's Dad's signature. What's this m memo book doing here? Ah, oh, there's Cheryl's book. This is my sketchbook from 17 years ago. On the front cover, here's a picture of Dad. A really awful work. What's this doing here? The door sure does rattle, but it's stuck tight. A secret is hidden out of your sight. You may be thinking, what could it be? You'll need five magic cards if you want to see. What to do then with all, with all these? I'll tell you straight and I won't tease. Just as long as you say please. Now the first thing you must know is that there's something in each row. But that is but that is not the half of it. Three would be too hard to fit. The upside down man under the ground, to his right, to his left, there's no one around. Leave him alone, though his tears are profound. The moon is up above the sky, full or crescent, floating high. Twinkling light sits like a crown on the head of a crazy clown. Your Excellency, praying to God Most High, do you think you can tell me why you always look up at the night sky? Do you have it now? You didn't forget one major point you must not omit. And now, at the last, before you take a whack, here's one more hint to help keep you on track. Scary and hateful that thing in the night. Better be careful it's not on your right. Turn to the left and you'll keep, in, you'll keep it in sight. So you'll open the door. I'm just sure that they'll... I'm just sure that there'll be nothing beyond it but frightening peril. Forget about that. Just stay and play or else I'll be left here alone all day. Okay. Those when I was seven, they don't fit me now. Good thing too. Right, okay, so we... This is where all the tarot cards go. I know it wasn't me. Alessa wrote this a long time ago. That chapel altar. It wasn't that one beautiful chapel. 
it was some other altar somewhere else. Grim! But for now, gonna end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later, this has been Silent Hill 3, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.